Alright, alright, welcome back. Wait, part 3. You alright? Tris? Yennefer. Seems so real in my dream, though. Was she nagging you about something? <laughs> mm -hmm. True to life, indeed. We'll find her. We'll find her. I know we will. That's not what worries me. You've seen, You've seen her tracks. She's a gallop all the time. The time. Her speed, her lines, devastated battlefields. She's in a hurry to get somewhere, or fleeing something. Either way, it means trouble of some sort. Be surprised if she wasn't in trouble. She's always poked her nose in beehives. Courtly intrigues here, mages conspiracies there. What do you expect? Don't know. Guess I thought once we were finally reunited, things would be calm, at least for a while. Calm? With Yennefer? <laughs> Good luck. In the dream, I went and found some Siri, and we trained. Those were the days. Mm, little she-devil. I've trained kids who were faster, stronger, but none had her character. Didn't end then well, did it? Your dream. No. A wild hunt appeared, attacked Siri. Siri couldn't move, stood there like a stump. It was just a dream. Be dawning soon, soon. Time to go. Wait, wait. Show me the letter from Yennefer. Might have overlooked some hint in there. Didn't overlook anything. We were meant to meet in Willoughby. That's what she wrote. She wrote. Meanwhile, one army or another burned the village to the ground. All we can do is follow her trail, so... Stop talking for a minute and give me the letter. Oh. How about that? It does, it does smell of lilac and gooseberries. We're gonna read it, not sniff it. We must meet. Soon. Soon. Willoughby near Vizima. Hmm. Oh, I I I there. What's this postscript? I still have the unicorn? That's private. Very private. Aha. I understand. At least I think I do. Maybe, maybe. I don't know what they were talking about, but whatever. Topic. How's it look? How far behind Yennefer are we? Two or three days. Trail's fresh. But it looks like at least these two of them could be muddled there. Wait. Hear that? I hear it. Yep. Ghouls. <laughs> Go, 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 go
Gilead. Ever tell you about this sort of sorcerer? I knew. Couldn't stop talking about how useful they are as creatures. Because you can brew potions from their blood? <laughs> no. Because by eating rotting corpses, they prevent epidemics. <laughs> Did you know they eat the living, living as well? Oh, no. Setting two. Is this theory collapsed? War is not exactly going our way. We have a side. The Northern Realms. Whoa, what the, the heck? heck? Tamaria and Eden are no more. Radivis place to restore borders. Not so Hold on, let me check the map right quick. It's the war. Believe that? <laughs> Gotta believe something. It's what keeps us going. Oh. That frame rate. That was a terrible frame rate. Say, Griffin. That was close. I was sure I'd end up like my mare. Provided you got luck, luck. Your horse died quickly, but Griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it, alive, piece by piece. Oh. You'd... You'd like a reward, I suppose. You don't owe us anything. You were in need. We helped. And they call witches heartless. Say they won't lift a finger without pay. They also say mice are born of rotting straw. Back to the trail. Like I said, leads to the main road and ends there, muddled. You seek someone? Yes, a woman. Medium height, long black hair. Seen anyone like that? No, but there's an inn here in White Orchard. Soul one around. Gets its share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn, you'll learn something there. Besides, the inky inky is my cousin. Her Bram, Bram sent you. She'll treat you like family. Not a bad idea. Especially since that wound needs cleaning. Ah, beast barely grazed me. But sure. Sure. It's a good rye. Nice and cool, you know. Straight from a cellar. Let's go. Alright. Yep, the horse teleported. <laughs> Alright, I guess I saved the game right here. And then just pull it.